Adrian. What's now up? We're live. Karul. Oh, this looks way better. I gotta like source out how this is gonna be. So today's episode will be a straight up quiz Thank show, you. okay? There you go. Merci. Mm. Yeah. Best squeeze! Nice of you to show up. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, so yes, we're doing a live show this time between Nick and G. They're going to be going at it. Are Winner. You switch seats? Hmm? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you should. Winner gets kicked out of the F word. This is the retirement match. Winner gets kicked out or loser no. gets kicked out? No, winner. <laughs> okay. If you win, you're out. <laughs> yeah. We are all the boys. If you win, win you lose. Do you want to go on a live stream on your phone? For sure. Yeah, see it. But yes, so we're going to be starting this up right away in like a minute. Loving the quality of the live stream, fellas. You know what? Thank you. It's like it's like kind of blurry here, I guess. Like, who cares? You know, <laughs> it's your Wi-Fi. Tell your mom to fix the goddamn internet bill, because I know you lift your mom. <laughs> yeah, roasted. So, Q and A. Uh, as soon as you're on the live stream, oh, just yeah, post I'm just doing a tweet. Just doing a tweet on the Twitter. You know, we're gonna sit here. If you have any questions before we start, feel free. Okay, here you go. Okay, excellent. We're getting straight into it. You guys waited too long. So why am I looking on here? No, just so I can see it. Why? Uh, oh, so you can... Oh, I get it. Yeah. I got lost. This is your water? Yes. Unless you want it. No. Are you brought two for me? I think so. Yeah. Well, you want two, yeah. Oh, no, no. There's one for you. Yeah, yeah. And then your other one. We've Where's started it? off great. We don't even know whose water is whose. Yeah. Let's Look at how clear. Is this how you are all the time? Just perfect? Nathan Hernandez. Nice. There's no need to roast us like that. What's the roasting? Nothing like three dudes in a room. Totally not a sausage fest. <laughs> wow. See, I don't know if that would be considered a sausage fest. I think if we had five of us, yeah, maybe. maybe. If it was a party and it was just guys, maybe. Yeah. But it depends what you're into, man. I mean, we're not into that. But. Okay, so uh, you just have to keep track of your scores because I have no piece of paper here. I forgot. That's fine. Help. I'll get you some paper. Yes. Okay, we're going to start. Rules of the quiz show is there are one. <laughs> Uh, two. I told you to get this thing ready. Man, you had one job. Three. Dude. There are four sections. Sections. Two of which are the same one. Okay. I'll score from there. So two are true and false. One is not. You'll find out. I'm not gonna spoil it. But take your bets now. Who will win, Nick or G? Or will they both lose and get sent out of the EF word forever? Well, so far the thing is, I won the. First one, yeah. you won the official one. Yeah. Like I won the test run, you won the official Christmas special. You won the last one. And show. then um, I have to win this one to this beat is you. Tiebreaker one. This uh, is the tie not officially. Officially, it's one. <laughs> this is a yeah. grudge match. <laughs> it's a so, fine. question number one this is true or false? Is Else. it whoever answers first? Sorry. Oh, well. Uh, or how are we doing this? Mmm, that's true. No. Answer first. Okay. And right. actually, both you will answer, I guess, at the same time. I'll count down. We'll see. All I ask you to do is get it yeah. correct. <laughs> you know what, man? How many true and false questions do you have for this part? I don't know, like nine-ish. Okay, so just go back and forth. I'll, I'll, you'll yeah. whisper in my ear, okay? Go, no, go back and forth and just do eight. So four and four, and then. Well, I don't know how many. Yeah. Okay. Just, go. Enough. You're making me really confusing. Okay. Have fun to your cousin's birthday, Vasquez. Oh Vasquez. My, you are disgusting with your excuses. He's Just not. get out of here. Get out! These are going live now on Sundays instead of Saturdays, so if you miss and you want to see it, I'm looking at you, Vasquez. It's up on Sunday. Okay. Elsa from Frozen. Okay. And Belle from Beauty and the Beast are actually related. True or false, Nick? G? Both said false and both are correct. One, one. Sweet. Moving on to the next question. It looks actually, speaking to a sausage party comment, it looks kind of weird yeah. when they're both like, <laughs> The nude portrait of Kate Winslet in Titanic was actually drawn by Leonardo DiCaprio. True or false? False. Wow, okay. Didn't even whisper in the ear. It's actually drawn by the director, wasn't it? James Cameron, yeah. who's apparently a fantastic artist. Mm -hmm. uh, da, da, da. Drawing boats, boats all day. Nick Cage actually turned down the role of Gandalf in the Lord of the Rings series. Nicholas Cage turned down the role of Gandalf? Nick Cage. False. False. He wasn't even yeah. offered it. No, he's offered some other role, Aragorn. Okay. He was offered the role of Aragorn? He actually, yeah, he turned down the role of Aragorn. Huh. Wow. 
<laughs> <That's>, idiot. <laughs> that, I'm surprised Peter Jackson actually offered him that role. Probably felt bad for him because of all the tax evasion <laughs> he needed to pay his No, bills. that happened after, or mm -hmm. was it the same? But Nicolas Cage, can you imagine? E.T. and Poltergeist were actually supposed to be the same movie. Or True. originally. True. The, the concept, I think, was supposed to be. He already said it, so I oh. You don't have to. Well, he could be wrong. Yeah. I could be. He says true. I'm going to say false. Okay, that was a horrible guess because he was right. All right. But. See, this is where the true and false out loud is where yeah. it's got to be. It's got to be the first person if the first person Does anybody says, know what it was originally called? Not for points, just for fun. Anybody know what, what it was originally the called? The movie was going to be originally called, both of them. E.T. the Poltergeist or whatever? I yeah. don't know. Night Skies. Night Skies? That would have been awful. So now this is first come, first serve. Okay. Uh, so if it is, you guys do both get the same answer, like you guys will both see an answer, but you guys both get the same one, it goes to the first guy who said it. Okay. So this is explain a film plot badly. Knows this guy has an unhealthy obsession with a teenage boy. What is that? Sorry? Knows this guy has an unhealthy obsession with a teenage boy. Knows this guy. Noseless. 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 Harry Potter. Potter. Okay. It's him. Hey, what's him? Okay. Yeah. That was gracious. Yeah. Uh, a mythical toad teaches people how to whack each other with neon tubes. A mythical toad? Mystical. A mystical toad with neon tubes. It's not Star Wars, is it? Yeah, it's Yoda. You're Sorry, right. you Star shouldn't Wars. have doubted yourself, G. Oh. <laughs> sure. Okay. <laughs> you called Yoda. Yeah. Talking frog convinces son to kill his dad. A talking what? Frog convinces his son to kill his dad. A talking frog convinces his son to kill his dad. That's also... Yeah. Star Wars. Okay, yeah. correct. I'm sorry, that wasn't really funny. I can pass it up. <laughs> now, here's a new one. Well, I guess they're all new. A young man forcefully binds other men and photographs them for money. Binds other men to photograph them for money. A young man forcibly binds other yeah, men yeah, forcibly. and photographs them for, for money. money. Mm. Any What's help out there, guys? <laughs> I'd like to call a friend. No. Yeah, I'd like to call a friend. Don't think too hard forcibly about this. Forcibly binds... The, there is... You own the movie. Yeah. There is an image of the movie yeah. on the wall behind me. Spider-Man? Spider-Man! Oh. So wow. it is 6, 5, yeah. G. Forcibly binds. He binds them. Binds takes photos. Yeah. Did you say friends? No, binds. No, what did you say? After? Forcibly binds other men. Other men. Other I should. I'm talking. Yeah, that's quite sexist. Yeah. You need to articulate. Yeah. Girl now brown gets now. roofied and is fine with it when she finds out that he is a solid ten. Girl gets roofied and is fine with it when she finds out he is a solid ten. Yeah. Once again, uh, it's not Sleeping Beauty, is it? <laughs> I don't know. Do your guess. Sleeping Beauty. Uh, sure. sure. I mean, she just fell asleep. I don't that, know. If she was. Uh, that's G's if he gets yes, it. Yes, it yeah. was. Oh snap! Yeah. Do not doubt yourself. I'm, if wow. somebody doubts, yeah, but him. she wasn't roofied by the prince. That's why that whole thing falls it doesn't apart. Doesn't matter. This girl gets roofied and is fine with it. You're no, pretty good at this one. She's, like, not, she's yeah. not fine with it though because he doesn't realize it until after. It's the no. An interracial couple <laughs> is chased by a white man and his burning cross. Interracial white couple. No, an interracial couple, couple. is chased by a white man mm -hmm. and his burning cross. And his burning things. That's like... Uh, an interracial couple is... Don't chased. think too hard about this. This is no, a bad... I know, but I'm just thinking about the, uh, burning the burning cross. Because all I'm thinking about is Lakeview Terrace with Samuel L. Jackson, because that was... <laughs> uh, it's not Get Out. Because uh, there's no burning cross there. Um, a hint. Cross. They're not actually a couple. Well, why would you say it's couple, couple then? Because, no, it's... You'll, it'll, oh, like, as in a couple of people. Interracial. Like, so a black and a white no. person? The, just, I don't want to give it away. Cause think about it. The movie came out two years ago and almost got number one worldwide for box office. Like, we almost made the most amount of money ever. Two years ago? Yeah. No, three. Twenty years now. ago. Twenty fifteen. I don't know. Yeah. You go for it. No, the don't. Force Awakens. 
Ray Fred and Cross, I guess, but uh, they're not an yeah. interracial couple. couple. Oh my god, that's not how it well, works. No, but don't give him a point. I'm he yeah. never got you were I'm a racing. I, okay, I get the Burning Cross now, yeah. but it's not the yeah. same thing. That's miserable billionaire terrorizes mentally ill man. Miserable billionaire terrorizes the men. Donald Trump story. Yeah, I was totally going. <laughs> Dang. You need to work on your tone. You're off. Yeah, I don't like your tone right now with me. <laughs> so, <back>. true or false? True. <laughs> At age 15, Jim Carrey quit school and became a janitor to support his family. True. true. At the time, they were living on the street. True. True. No, false? In a car. They were living in a car. They was on a car. I will give you that. that. That's a good one. I forgot about the car. I overwhelmed with it. Well done. In 2006, an Australian man tried to sell New Zealand on eBay. The price rose to 13000 before eBay shut it down. True. False. False, it was 3000 before they shut it down. After being asked... Who? Oh, oh good for you. You follow your tape facts. <laughs> After being asked a question in an interview, you should read the answers. Sorry, you should read the answers and like kind of build it up a little bit before you give the official one. Let the people answer to the question. So, you'll have a 10 second break to answer this. After being asked a question in an interview, Stanley claimed that Goku from the Dragon Ball franchise would lose to Superman. True or false? Think. 10, 9, 8, Seven. I'm gonna say false. Six. Five. False That's too. enough time. I was going slow. <laughs> it was false. He said that Goku could beat Superman. Really? Sweet. Last one. Oh no, there's two more for true false. Sorry. Okay. This is a good one. Jim Caviezel. Caviezel. Caviezel was struck by lightning while filming the Sermon on the Mount in The Passion of Christ, and was also whipped accidentally twice got hypothermia, and broke his left arm. True. False. Right he dislocated arm. his shoulder, uh, then break his arm. You know, you can't make them that multi-layer. Yeah, okay? yeah. That's, uh, that's... It's that's, my show. I can do whatever the hell I please. Okay. That's a little bit too elaborate. Wow. Last one for true and false. Then we're on to bad impressions, where you guys get to try and guess my bad impressions. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. So last we were right, it, except for one out of the yeah. eight details that he had there, we were off by one. Yeah, okay. so... Uh, he dislocated his second finger. <laughs> uh, it was actually the index on the fourth finger on the Enough left hand impressions. side. That's my job. Anyway, Dr. Seuss's widow, Audrey Giesel, hated the cat Audrey. in the hat. <laughs> True. Film so much that she vowed to never allow another True. live action. Can you shut the hell up? True. Is he right? Yes. yes. Well, then give him the point. I, oh. I should have changed the last bit so you'd be Well, wrong. unlike your other one with the multi layered one, at least we knew. This and one. then what she did is she went home, she made a tuna casserole, some roast beef, and had a salad. The people False. are wrong. It was macaroni <laughs> salad. <laughs> the people are playing with us right now, and you're being rude to their ads. Look, I can see Daniel Amiel is like, what, what the hell? <laughs> Yeah, it's true. Yeah, Calm Shack, yeah, we all know you cheated, so you know what, enough of you. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> okay, I now... I got so excited that I, I'm Nick, catching up. Nick is down by one point. Yeah. He's on a bit of a hot streak. But we're moving on to bad impressions, where the first person to spit out the impression wins the point. You can spit out as many times as you like okay. until you get it. Okay. But I mean, just be nice. Like, let the other guy try and guess. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so... There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight impressions, and okay. you're down by one, so I don't know. We can do this. Yeah, there's, yeah, oh, there's, there's a gonna be a winner no matter what. Yeah. I didn't expect you guys not to get any points for some of these rounds, but you guys somehow managed to do that. Mm -hmm. okay. Moving on. First impression. Batman. <laughs> <laughs> Is it right? No. That would be hilarious. <laughs> okay, go. Oh boy, that's really pissing me off right now. Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. <laughs> It is 10 to 8. Mouse Clubhouse. <laughs> Next one. Worst sandwich ever. <laughs> you guys really pissing me off right now. I'm going to build a wall and you're going to Donald Trump. Trump. Yeah, you said, you said Trump first. first. 9 to 10. Your impressions are Next horrible. One. Actually, yeah, the Mickey Mouse one wasn't bad. <laughs> Next one. That's true. You'll eventually hit puberty. Where are the drugs? It's Batman. Batman. <laughs> Dark Knight. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just to make it interesting, it is 10 to 10. <laughs> Next one. I hate the bot. 
Oh, broke the ball. Oh, Bane. Uh, Bane. 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 Yeah, Ooh. Fumbled. 11 to 10. Oh, is it the lines. movie or the character we have to say? Character. Okay. Bane the character. Okay, now this one is heavily favored, Nick. I'm sorry. If you get this, you are horrible. Yeah! Fire! Vince McMahon. Mm. <laughs> that could have been Donald Trump as well. Now, ready? <laughs> Mario. Super Mario. Oh, shit. Super Rock, paper, scissors right now. Oh, he's ahead. Twelve to eleven. There are two left. Right. No, yeah, one guy's gonna you win. Can't this. win. <laughs> cannot win. Ready? Sweep the leg. <laughs> Sweep the leg. No mercy. No mercy. Okay. okay you're the this? best you around. How do I do this? No one's gonna ever take you down. You're the best. <laughs> hey, <laughs> my hand is off. Your mouth was shut. Ready? King miss. Michael Jackson. Boom. That was Michael Jackson. <laughs> if I don't know why can, I high five you, I just lost. He, if he can guess it. Okay, now it there's one like, last uh, impression. It sounded yeah. like a gay R2D2. <laughs> do you want to do. Will you give. Do you want to do a double or nothing? No. No, let's, get, let's do this. Okay, last one. Let's go. Christmas, Christmas time. Alvin and the Chipmunks. Yo. Oh, I'm so glad I didn't give uh, Risk at all. Wow. Risk okay, yeah. that was it for the quiz show. Went by fast. I had lots of fun. Now we have some quests. You just read That's it of the show? There's no nothing? Quiz show. We're done with the quiz show? Well, yeah. We, oh, how long do you have to yeah, So you went. That was four won. rounds, yeah. Good job. So the grudge Dude, match. That when it, okay, sorry to interrupt, but by the way, the the the, the bad plot one? Dude, that one you was doing crushed all right. it. There was a couple I missed that were easy. You but, crushed uh, it. You're now two. It's two nothing for you now. Yeah, well. It's, this saga will continue. This saga will continue. If you guys did like the quiz show, I know it was kind of fast, but... We were also furious, so we could do it every week. It was kind of, you know... That was fun. Yeah. We should do it every week. Yeah, we should. We'll bring we out should. the pedestals next really time, too. Should. Oh boy. I enjoy winning. I'm excited! <laughs> Let's read the comments! It's actually pretty good. Ho -ho. Ho -ho. So we have some people playing, some people... Um... Some people said I don't know... Uh, so... Hello, Dan the Man. Dan the Man. Is P storing the balls, says Oren. Owen? Is who? P storing the balls. Yeah. What? He stored in the balls. Oh. Like, biologically speaking. No. No? Bladder. Bladder. Where's the... He is stored in the bladder. Well, where's the bladder? In the balls? No. no. Bladder's like... Bladder's in like your pelvic area and then there's like... Top. That's why if someone pokes here and you need to pee, yeah. you're poking your bladder. Uh, right here. Tom Shack asked, do you know how to hack Future Fight? Sperm is in your balls. How to hack and Future Fight? No, I don't. Because, you know, he plays it. Up, up, down, down. Left, left. I wish. <laughs> R1, R2, L1, R2, left down, right up, left down, down, If down. you want the final code for uh, Mike Tyson's punch out, though, it's uh, 007373 in the original Super Mario. The uh, original remembers. Nintendo. That is to get to the end. That is to get to the end. If you guys are just joining now and you have missed the live or the quiz show, <clears throat> it'll be released really Sunday. So you can watch and play along. Mm -hmm. Are we good? Yeah, yeah, we're good. Oh, yeah. Oh, we'll be any. This is going to be a shorter last year. Okay. It is. Yeah. But, uh, you know, me and G just watched the show, or what movie? Veronica. I'm not gonna say much about it, because we're gonna do a Veronica, review later. But, if you guys like horror films, Sorry. and things in Spanish, it's a good one. It's there, so yeah. So how do you guys feel about Infinity War coming? <laughs> like anybody else, Amazeballs, that it's coming out. Oh, Arturo Man, Music right? Man. He's in. Oh, wait. Is your profile picture a photo of him wearing the shirt? Oh, oh snap! Nice. I will pull it up on my phone. I'll go on your account right now. Um, yeah, no, it's awesome. That'll be good. That means that. Well, and the other thing too is, for them to move it up, it's the same thing they did with Civil War. Uh, Civil War, they released the embargo for reviews. I think a month and a half earlier. So whenever they do that, it shows a lot of confidence in the film. Mm -hmm. If they don't do that, they have no confidence. They make sure that. I know the worst indicator that a movie's not going to do well is if they remove the embargo for all Justice reviews League. day of oh, okay. or let's say the night before or like opening day that's when you have an idea that okay this isn't going to do very well mm -hmm. but for them to remove it up um i don't know what else it was competing against some other stuff nice. let's see that's awesome arturo music man i know you can't see any can't of this see it from there but the shirt's looking nice looks good on you the chain really nice, touch, yeah. nice touch nice yeah. touch can i have my phone back <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll do it. Uh, Please don't touch his phone. Okay, real quick. Um, but anyways, yeah, no. Yeah. April 27th is good. We just gotta get our tickets in time. Mm -hmm. The Comp Shack asked, uh, I hear Tony Stark is supposed to lose 
an arm in Infinity War because he has his blaster on his arm. So good. I was like, oh. Good. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say is good. Good. Let him lose an arm. Yeah. Yeah. He you could. Know. He could. The man generate another. You know, it costs one. Marvel an arm and leg to afford the man, so I think it's fair that he loses an arm. If he does, yeah, I liked it the first time when it was called Star Wars. Get it? <laughs> <laughs> Skywalker. No. I don't want to cut you off there, but I will. Yeah. Uh, no, but that's why they do it anyways. Like, it was an homage. Uh, that's what Joss Whedon did. It's an homage to the Star Wars movies. So every movie, someone's arm is being... That was in Phase uh, 2. Oh, really? Or Phase 2, sorry. After the Avengers. Two. Yeah. Mm. Um, for that reason. So that was pretty cool. That is cool. Because yeah. the most So, um, I don't see... It wasn't that far off in the end. Well, no. Like, Ulysses yeah. Claw lost his arm in Ultron. Uh, Bucky gets Spoilers. his arm off in the last one. Ultron came out, what, four years ago? Three no. years ago? Three? Yeah, three. Three? Well, no, sure. more, more like close to two. Whatever. Um, yeah, for, there's... For the three people on this planet who have not seen the movie. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah. I was in watch in five years, no? Forget yeah. it. Ruined. 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 It's ruined. Yeah, someone's out, someone out there is not watching any of these, so when it's officially done, he can watch the full box set. It's like, <laughs> dude, you're way behind. Yeah. <laughs> it's 2020, What's man. an Iron Man? What's an Iron Man? It's a like, challenge you do when you run. Um, Leonardo DiCaprio and Brad Pitt in a Tarantino movie. Really? Uh, I put it on our Facebook, and it's kind of like they're on board and they're in talks. I don't know if it's the Manson movie, but that's what the word is on the street. The F word on the street. The F word on the street. I think this battery's gonna die. Like, these cameras just. That's like... fine. The show's pretty much over. We. we... <laughs> Real confident there. <laughs> what do you mean? I thought this was gonna be a much shorter one. It is, because we had the quiz show. Yeah. yeah. We'll go until this battery is dead. Once this battery is dead, then we'll sign off. Yeah. Probably give us both. The Con Shack claims it pisses me off because you think actors would appreciate their fans instead of charging them for autographs. The thing is, you show up to a con to meet an actor, they will charge you just because, like, yeah. they have to make money somehow. But if you see them on the street, not many actors are gonna be like, okay, yeah, uh, five bucks. They'll just, you know, do whatever. To get somebody to come to a con, um, is that is with those perks that you do have yeah. to pay money to get it, especially the big ones. I mean, if you go to a I'm concert, a like he was mentioned, if you're outside, if you see them and they sign something, then that's great. But when you're actually there in the venue that whatever place is is, is uh, keeping them there, especially like the, the very not well-known actors from the old movies, like, you know, whatever. And he, my friends see him. I wasn't there with them. Like, I was somewhere else. But my friends see him walking around. He's like, oh, hey, uh, we get a photo with you? He's like, oh, yeah, sure. Just come by my booth. <laughs> and I'd love to do it for you. And they're like, oh, so this guy's actually gonna like force us to go to his booth, pay him to get a picture, and so just like, of course. Oh, what an ass. Yeah. Again, these guys, like, those they're guys. Because they're smaller league, right? Yeah, they like, are smaller league. They've got 15 minutes of fame and they've got to, like, One thing I try love, to though, get that is, like, I'll go, to, I'll go to these expos and I'll meet these uh, voice actor guys, and they charge, like, half as much, and they'll actually talk to you. Like, I remember I was talking to Sean Schemmel, who's a voice actor for Goku, and I was talking about entertain facts. Like, oh, yeah, your fact page, she's a fact that everybody gets wrong about me. He tells me this fact about him that, like, we're commonly wrong. Yeah. He's just a nice guy. Just start talking. That's cool. There's a fine line between the business side of things and the personal side of things, like, I don't know. Again, if you know that you've got like a sh limited shelf life, I guess, in your career, and you got to make as much money as you yeah. can, like, and that's and like some of these guys are like incredibly bitter too because they they go what? to these things and they hope they like Virgil, like the wrestler. I don't know, you probably don't remember Virgil, like Million Dollar Man's right hand guy. Like the guy still charges like forty bucks for his signatures. Nobody goes to, nobody gives a shit. I don't know. Well, I think Hart the big thing. I think the other but thing. I think Bret Hart's more respectful. Well, Bret Hart was the five time WWE champion right i think the thing Speaking though is that um the other thing i forgot to mention they sign it you can easily turn around and charge for it yeah someone will like you pay 50 bucks for it someone will pay you 150 bucks for a sign yeah. something uh you you spend 100 dollars on a, and get captain america to sign your play shield, shield. Yeah, someone will buy a chris evans sign that's a good for 500 bucks so i think for them too it's like why are you benefiting from my signature? Yeah. So maybe that's a way to they're offset it. They're the wholesaler it. and they're yeah. the, the other See, the thing was, together. like, you wouldn't, I don't think you know who this guy was. Zack Ryder, he had these Funko Pops. Zack Ryder! these Funko Pops come out, like, just recently. It was an exclusive thing. And he was at the airport, because WWE wrestlers, you know, travel there and from, and they see a bunch of people and they sign stuff. And this guy, he signed the, a little bit of the image of the box mm -hmm. just to see eBay in mm -hmm. case he'd go and sell it. And he did, and he started flaming him for it because... Oh, really? Like, they don't really like that. You know, they don't want people to go and, like, take their signature because people will come up with multiple things to get signed. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And speaking of, you said the championship. 
uh, on Twitter, some guy was flaming the wrestling, like pro wrestling, saying, "Why are you so happy you get a title? It doesn't mean anything. You guys like just want it because they wanted you to win it." And Edge came up <laughs> saying, "It's not about winning the title. It's about getting recognized for all the hard work you do and getting rewarded sure. for it." Mm-hmm. Yeah. So he, uh, yeah, I thought that was kind of funny and interesting and true. Yeah. Okay, uh, the contract says the man that played Darth Sidious is coming here to Lexington, KY next week. Oh, I'm going to see Jason David Frank, the original Green Ranger. I did, and maybe oh. Darth Sidious, I don't know if he just brought through that in there. But Very cool. I think that, I think I've heard that uh, Dave, Jason Frank is actually a really nice guy. Because he's not really that big anymore. He just kind of, he does like YouTube videos now. Like Does stunts for his, because of the Bat in the Sun. There are some like, you know, like they do live action battles. He's in there reprising his role, just doing stunts for them and, you know, whatever. Sweet. You've been, to, you've been to conventions before. Have you ever been to one? No. I've never, I'd like to go. Like I, I to was going to go to the one that you went to. I went to a tattoo convention by accident because I was at a wine convention and a tattoo one was right next door. Uh, luckily, I didn't get wasted and get a tattoo because <laughs> that right there together was, I was, that's the first thing I was thinking. dangerous combination. This is a crazy combination right now yeah. because that is possible. Yeah. Oh, and he says Norris is coming. So he's charging Chuck Norris. Yeah, ninety five dollars. That was Chuck Norris. Yeah, idea. that's Chuck See, Norris. Too. But no, like Mark Hamill charges like two hundred dollars, I think. Yeah. Which is insane because you know Mark Hamill. You've Where done, are you winking? So. Oh. You've done watching you technically live. Like, <laughs> you've done right one, at you, baby. Done one good thing in the past how many years? Mark Hamill. He's a spectacle. Mark Speaking awesome. of, no, he's a horrible actor. Mm. Does his signature he's go up great, because he technically um, died in the last movie? <laughs> <laughs> Luke Skywalker's signature goes up in stock because of that. Yeah. But one thing is, apparently, he's gonna be in the new Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah, I don't know what I don't want him to be. You know what? I wouldn't mind him to be, but it depends so, on. I'm sorry, he's a horrible actor. I think the big thing is it. It all depends on how big of a role he's in. What it's was it's too bad that he had that really bad motorcycle accident when he was younger, because like that. Yeah. I think that's what really like changed him. Maybe. Like drastically not just physically but like in terms of his acting well that's why he looks so like different that. in empire as oh, well yeah right? yeah for sure well i they have to add that add that scene where he's hanging around got like the crap beat out of him and had the right. bruises because he actually yeah got messed up got messed yeah up, so. arturo says have you guys heard about dc and marvel possibly in the talks of having a multiverse mute multiverse multiverse of okay, two times that's why multiverse together in the comics I didn't hear about the comic side. I know it's been like they've they've talked about it, but more so like, hey, would you guys want to do that? I'm like, yeah, sure, we'd want to do this, but I can see that happening. Yeah. Eventually, the comics have to do something major, like Batman and the Ninja Turtles. I thought was a big deal, like when the Ninja Turtles teamed up with Batman in the comic book line. I, I thought that was. Oh, I don't remember that. Oh, I, I read them. I didn't buy. Like, well, I bought them. Could have been that online. big one. Uh, put them in the store and put yeah. it back on the <laughs> shelf. <laughs> uh, we don't, I don't think we have comic book stores here. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Right by McDanks. Do we? Yeah. Oh, okay. But anyways, yeah, and no, uh, I could see that happening. I didn't hear about it, but I could see it happening. Yeah. The contract says, how bad was the motorcycle accident? I've never heard of that. Just search it up. He had bandages all over his face. Yeah, yeah. and again, if extensive, you go... Extensive damage, extensive, uh, like, plastic surgery was needed. Like, his whole face, like, if you look at the original Star Wars, the way his face was, and, like, that, yeah, so go to the second fault. one, like, there was a, there was a, a major... Big difference. There was a major difference, yeah. Like, his face major used to difference. be, like, more oval, and then it became kind of, like, more puffy. squared out. Yeah. yeah. Crazy. And the comp check says he's had he's a Ninja Turtles blanket with him right now. Okay, I still have um like I, I actually took it to work because a friend of mine at work is a big Ninja Turtles fan. I have like the uh the, the toy that would throw the pizza discs. Oh nice. Yeah. You have the truck? Yeah, I have the truck. Wow. I, have, I have the blimp at home. Wow. Like at my parents' house. Yeah. That's awesome. I have, like, well, give it, you give it to your work friends to play with, but he says he's got a Ninja Turtles blanket playing with, with. It. Yeah. Nice, smart. I used to have both. I had the one where it was like just their heads I floating around. Really it was a white sheet. It was a white blanket sheet. Yeah. That had uh, yeah, their heads are all over the place. It was oh, awesome. Cool. Did you just hear that now? No. No. We just brought that up before. That's how we got to talk about the Ninja Turtles. Did you? Oh, I decided. <laughs> I was waiting for you to react, but yeah, yeah you were um, lost in thought. I guess. I also my first birthday was a Michelangelo cake. Really? My parents got me it. Yeah. Oh no way. Well, your first birthday you remember or like your first? I, there's a picture of me on my first birthday with a Michelangelo cake. Oh, very cool. Yeah. Yeah. It was destined. I played Leonardo in the uh, school play. There's a school play with the Ninja like, Turtles? Well, it was actually a Christmas concert. <laughs> Am I allowed to say Christmas concert? It was actually, Is it a winter concert? It was actually a retelling of uh, famous artists. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they was, put me in a smog and a puffy shirt. It was sucked. It a retelling of how Jesus got born, but like, Team T version? 
No. Um, no, it wasn't. They were the MCs, actually. Oh, it's really God. bad now. We're like, go ninja, go ninja, go. Go ninja, go yeah. ninja, go. Down. We, we didn't do that. Down. Why? Down, down, I don't know. Down. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Was that before your time? It was before my time. Actually, no, I remember that show. Wow, Stop the, the microphone, man. Someone's going to freak out. Good. But yeah. Wait, I think you need to wrap this up. Yeah, this, is, yeah, this has been fun. Yeah, it's been a short one. Uh, what does Sophia say? How many times do you guys think the word family is said in Fast and the Furious? <laughs> I think it's... <laughs> I do not watch the Fast and the Furious. I heard of the spin-off uh, called The Fly and the Curious. That's an inside joke for sure. Uh, you know what? I think I counted the one time and there was at least 13. That's it? I thought there'd be more than that. No, no, no. 13 is a lot. Family. 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 Uh, I think what I'm going to have to do is count do. next time. When I do my Fast and Furious videos, <laughs> yeah. I'll do it. But they don't say it in the first one. They don't say it... I think they say it once in the first one. Uh, they don't say it in the second one. They don't say it in the third one. They start saying it from Fast and Furious. And then the specifically Fast Five until eight, it's f like just family, a rain family. of family. Like, it's and crazy. And Corona beer. And Corona beer. Oh, I've never seen a Fast Corona. and Furious. You've never seen any of them? Oh, dude. Really? Dude. <laughs> wow. There's something else. Don't see Tokyo Drift. You know what? Tokyo Drift is the what most authentic it? one out of all of them. They had the actual DK from Tokyo that was on set showing them how to do it. So the moves that they were doing were actually accurate. Wow. Uh, they should have picked a different main character. Yeah. Um, but no, it, 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 it was the most legit. Uh, because I have no one, seen all of them, yeah. Yeah, no one granny shifts. Like in the first one. Double clutching, not, or sorry, what is it? Uh, granny shifting, not double clutching like you should. Nobody double clutches <laughs> in a vehicle. And if you go and you write double clutching, there's forums of people like <laughs> saying, he's like, no one says that. No one <laughs> said it to sound like they're car guys. It's so funny. Why do they call him DK? Donkey Kong? Nope. Ah, Drift King. Absolutely. No, just the memes. Oh. So many memes. Anyways, Anyways. this was fun. Yeah. Yeah, make water. Sure you subscribe. <laughs>